Good evening. Hello, good evening. Good evening, Patrice. Good, good evening, evening. Luis. Well, guys, um, welcome once again to another class, guys. It's it's a pleasure to see you once again. Well, I haven't. I only see some of you. The other ones are I have never seen your faces. But I mean, uh, it's really nice that you're here and that you're always on time. As I always tell you, I do appreciate that. And uh, the question that I always ask you before we start: Are you listening to me clearly? Or do we still have the same situation that we had yesterday? I listen clear, teacher. Okay, great. So uh, thank you so much once again for being here today on time. I do appreciate that. So as usual, guys, I'm going to start asking you questions regarding to the last topic that we saw. Yesterday, it was... Uh, Let's say it was a lot of information that we saw, actually. We saw a lot of things which maybe were not 100% clear for some of you, but for some other others, probably it was, it was fine. So today we're going to, travel, uh, to try to have a brief recap before we start today's class. So as usual, I'm going to ask you questions regarding to that, uh, just for me to have a to have like, uh, or to verify actually, if you guys understood a little bit about what we saw. And uh, so let's start and let me ask you some questions regarding to that. Let me see, yesterday we saw particles, right? And we focus in different things and different situations or different parts of the grammar in which we can use particles. But, but specifically, we were we or we we checked like phrasal verbs right we saw the different types of phrasal verbs and how we can use them like if they are separable or inseparable so we saw those things so let me let me try to verify if you guys remember some of the rules or some of the structures that we saw so i will write a sentence on the chat and I will ask you questions regarding to that. Let me write this down. So that's the first one. Let me see the number two. So now we have two sentences on the chat. And I will uh, I would like to ask you which one do you consider is the correct one or is the best option or which one would would you choose regarding to the phrasal verb give up? Which one would you choose? Do you guys have any idea about it or we, are we still lost? O todavía estábamos agarrando señal. Teacher, uh, I am lost. You're lost. Yes, but como no recibí la clase ayer, no pude recibir. Yeah, I know you were not here yesterday. I understand that. So it's it's fine. I mean, you can check the class later on on the 
on the YouTube channel if you want to. But the other ones were here. I remember Sonia was here, Elizabeth was here, Emperatriz, I guess she was here, Maximo, who is always here, Rosemary was here, and I guess Patricia was also here. So my question is for all the others, except you, Luis, because I understand that you were not here yesterday. So which one do you 